last but not the least question. So this is a Miss Universe yung question. Niya. Grabe, na po wawa ko na. <laughs> so her her question was, if you were given a chance to be Miss Universe, single mom edition, what is your greatest and sincere advice to the next generation? Don't forget to like, subscribe to my channel. Hello, hello everyone. It's me again, Marin, and welcome to my channel. Um, tonight's vlog, as you can see, I'm wearing my PJs already. But before going to bed, I need to do this vlog. So without further ado, let's get without further ado, let's get started. So last time I posted in my Facebook, in my Facebook, um, this what is it? This question. Like, I know, I posted this in my Facebook. I said, for my next video, so YouTube channel ko, so, sabi ko, I post like this. You can drop here in my comment section whatever questions you like to know or to ask about me. Game the game akong sagutin with all honesty lahat. So, yon. So, the first comment was, the first comment Yung sa comment section ko was my daughter. She's asking. So, it's in our dialect. Okay. It's Ilongo dialect. So, I'm going to try to translate it in English. So, peace, peace in advance. Because, I'm not that good in English. And I know that. So, bear with me. Okay. <laughs> so, the first question. Sino guapa ka natin ma? So, she said, uh, what is it? Who is more beautiful than the two of us? So, baby girl, this is your question, so I'm going to answer it. Ikaw, you are beautiful. You're beautiful than me. You are the upgraded version of me. Kasi ikaw yung perfect combination namin ng papa mo. So, happy? Total package ka, my height, my talent, matalino. So, you can be, be my future Miss Universe, Char. Baka nga kung naginib lang. So, the, her second question was, number two. My plano ka pa mama na ma. So, that's, uh, ano, in English, do you still have plan to marry? And then, the next is, kung mama na ka uliwat ma, if you're going to marry again, ma, mabata ka uliwat, are you, are you planning to have a child again? So, the first, let's go to her, my plano ka pa mama na. So, are you still planning to marry, ma? So, before, last three years ago, no. Because my mind got a heart was closed for committing into a new relationship. Kasi so, but I, I love my hus I love my husband so much, so it's a no. And but now that uh, lately last uh, like 2019, 2020, nag sinking nasa mind ko na oh, it's so sad to ano, it's so sad to be single. Sabi kong ganun, tao lang naman ako, I, I'm only human, so I need love, I'm not a robot, so I have feelings also, so I'm longing for love, but I'm waiting for the right person to give it to me, in God's perfect timing. So yes, I'm, I am planning to marry again. <laughs> so if I'm going to marry again, do I have plans to have a child again? Yes, I do. Once you love the person, and if that person wants to have his own child from me then yes so yeah that's how i love him so i'm, I'm willing to have another another child i know this is this bit i know this is the question that makes you don't want me to have or to be in a relationship before nung bata ka pa. and my answer is even though i have a new family like i have a new husband or I'm committed into someone else and me having a child with him it will not change the fact that you will always be my priority my love is always fair to the per especially to my children the love that I will give is and attention is fair Ganon. Patas lang dapat. so don't worry baby girl <laughs> Kahit, uh, even though I have my own family you will never be left behind I know that those are the things that you are worried if ever na mag-asawa ako ulit or mag-aanak ako ulit. So, I'll make sure. Uh, visit, bear this in your mind. Put in your mind. Remember this. Kahit mag-asawa ako ulit, 
you will always be my priority. Okay, my children, you, my children, is my life. Husband, I can change it. Char. <laughs> Char, no, no, no. If if it doesn't work, it, a man, I can find it anywhere. But you, my children, you are my life. Okay, so, so I need a man who can love you. Okay, who can love the two of you, not only me. Who can help me raise the two of you. Okay, so... I'm waiting for the God's time to to him to give it to me. Ano ba yun? Ang gulo. Sorry sa English. <laughs> so, trying hard ang lola niya. So, mga kalola, peace, okay? Peace in advance, mga kalola. So, the next question. Zell Morales, ilang years ka na bang single mom? At bakit di mo naisip or... Naisip mo na bang magkaroon ulit ng partner sa buhay and when? So, ilang years, how long I've been single? I've been single since 2000, January, January 2, 2016 until now. So, yeah, it's almost five years that I've been single and I've never been committed to someone since my husband passed away. Okay? Bakit di ko naisip? Yes, before, I've never thought of it like what? I said to my daughter to her questions, yeah, past three years, I wasn't okay. I wasn't healed. I, I can't, my heart is so close for new love. But lately, yes, um, I want love. I'm longing for love. And I want someone to give that love that my children cannot give, which we know that the love of the children of the family is different from the love of the partner, okay? <laughs> so before, yes, and the more I said that I don't want to marry again, the more, the more, the, the more the merrier. <laughs> no, the more na sinasabi kong, no, I don't want to marry again. But the more yung temptation, ang daming dumadating. Gandang dilag, puso ko yung nabihag. Wala nang minanais. My heart is so close for new love. So, But yes, now I am willing to love again, to marry again, to the one who is deserving of my love. And I know my worth and I just don't go out kung sino-sino lang dyan. And then, kahit single love, even though I'm a single mom, I still have my standards, okay? Don't just... Don't uh, just think that uh, even if I'm a single man, kahit sino na lang dumating and then go again. No, no, no. Mas tumaas yung standard ko kaya. <laughs> okay. Mm. So, when when am I going to marry again? I don't know. And now, as of now, I don't have anybody. I'm still single and yeah, there's people who want expressing their feelings towards me, but I don't want, I want, I want, I don't like verbal. I want action. I want effort. So I want someone who will love me for who am I, who will love my soul more than my body. Because I don't have, I don't have a body to be proud of. So look, I, I only have, you know, I'm a mother. So being a mother, you know, my body is not the same. Like, Yung hindi, hindi siya, hindi na the same yung katawan mo nung dalaga pa ako. So, don't expect, okay? Madi-disappoint lang kayo. If you love me, just love me. I can give you the love, the, what is it? The, the loyalty na hinahanap mo. Lahat ng klase ng pagmamahal, okay? Kung performance lang yung hanap mo. If you only want me because I'm, I'm beautiful. <laughs> if you only want me because I'm beautiful, then go. I don't want someone who will love me because of my look. Hindi naman ako kaganong kaganda, pero I know... I know I'm beautiful. <laughs> My mother said I'm beautiful, so mother's knows best. Okay? <laughs> okay, let's do the what is it? I'm just waiting for God's perfect timing. Okay. God's perfect timing, God's divine timing, and I'm praying for the that one person. Whom I can be with for the rest of my life. I don't want to just, what is it? I don't want to settle for less because I know my worth. Okay, so next question for Shirley, from Shirley and Sue. So her is the question. My boyfriend ka na ba ngayon? 
may boyfriend ka ba right now? Yung toto, naka full caps lock siya na. Lahat naka caps lock, all caps lock. So for now, no. Single. Since single since 2 January 6, 2016. Like I said so many times. So this is the third time na nare-repeat ko na since my husband passed away. I'm single until now. So I'm waiting for the for the right man, for the one to make me fall in love deeper each uh fall in, to make me fall in love day by day. Sure. So kaso yung iba ano yung first attempt pa lang na sinopladahan ko na ano <laughs> nag-back out na kasi na-intimidate na sa strong personality ko. So <laughs> so sorry, you don't deserve me. You have to work hard to get to get to get my attention. Pero pag yung may maraming nagme-message before, oh, ang dami nila. Oh, yeah. Pero hindi ko pansin kasi I don't feel any connection. Kahit konti. Pag yung ramdam, kung walang connection, I don't reply to their message. I, hindi ko sila pinaasa. Pinapaasa. I, I go to, I go straight to the point na, I don't like you. So, ganun. Ganun ako. Di ba? Feeling maganda, no? <laughs> Magandang dilag Puso ko yung nabi Next question. From Bibelin to Bilia. So, an o kao mama na liwat. So, in English, when are you going to marry again? I don't know. It's God. Only God knows. I don't know. I'm waiting for... I'm waiting for the one to make me fall in love. So, yeah. I'm going to tell you, Beb, if when is that going to happen. Maybe next year or soon or whatever. I don't know. Let's wait for... Let's wait until it happens. Okay? <laughs> so, from Girlie Pagorayan. Yung pinakamatalinong baba yung pinakamatalino ng tanong na meron siya dito mamaya makikita niya so from Gertie Pagorayan here is her question how you like to be comforted when you are sad or upset simple i just detach myself from the outside world i go to my own little world like for example last last 4 days ago i uninstalled my Facebook, but before doing that, I I deleted my profile pic, I deleted my cover photo, I and then I uninstalled it, and then I off my act my active status in my messenger FB only messen FB messenger left until now it's still uninstalled. Di ko pa na install yung Facebook ko, so I install only fa only what is it only facebook messenger is working and then i remember my friend called me <laughs> she called me twice in facebook messenger and in my personal number and then she sent me a message and then i ignored her <laughs> you know i don't want to talk so when i'm not sad and sad i don't want to talk to anybody even though even even my daughter she sent message to me just let me be in my own world now. I don't want to talk to him anybody, okay? So she said, okay. Are you okay? I'm okay. I, I, I can handle myself. Just let me heal myself right now, okay? And just, I didn't tell her that I cried, okay? I cried the whole day during my holiday. I, I stayed in my room on my bed under my blanket, under in my bed in my blanket in my dark room with the love songs on and then i cried keep crying keep crying to feel to, to make me feel better so i feel better now and i also uninstalled my instagram <laughs> no instagram the thing that the apps that left for me is what um and then you tiktok and facebook and fb messenger yun those are the apps that I'm using until now because I'm still not using my Facebook and the Messenger. So, but I, I seldom open my TikTok. I don't even want to dance. Like, I don't know what happened to me. You know, it makes me, you know, the reason of my sadness and why am I upset? Because I saw videos on my Facebook. Couple, happy couples, happy family, complete family. So, ganun. Nagsiselos ako. I'm jealous. I don't know why. That's, yung material things na makakita sa iba, hindi ako, I'm not that jealous when it comes to 
material things. Hindi ako naiinggit or necessary. So, kung anong meron yung iba. Yung pinagsasalosan ko lang is a happy family, a uh, complete family. That's the only thing that makes me feel jealous and sad and upset. Kasi, sabi, I would always say, dati masaya, but now look. So, I, I'm, I'm, I'm longing for that complete family that I had before. So, ganun. And especially when I'm angry, I don't want to talk. Just leave me alone. Just let me, let me, what is it? Let me enjoy the pain. Bear, what is it? Let me enjoy the pain first. And I'll be okay. After like three to four days, I'll be okay. So, okay, that's it. <laughs> and from Maria Idelin. My question is, in your honest and sincere opinion, is it really necessary to send your boyfriend a new photos? For me, no. Why? If, you, if he really loves you, if he really, if he really respects you, he will not ask those things that only married couple should do. Ganun. <laughs> Ganun. Kasi, what if mag-break kayo? Ano mangyayari? What if hindi kayo magkatuluyan? And then, Nagalit siya sa you and then she will send it to his friends. Yung iba pa kalat niya, ganun. O sino masisira, di ba? Yun dapat dapat. Antay niyo mag-asawa kayo pag mag-asawa na, pwede na. Sorry, yeah, sorry, sorry, sorry. <laughs> and what is it? From uh, from Panga. This is from Panga Tenya Fiel. Trixie Tenya Fiel, she is my Bargada. So the question is, this is her question. What if one day, as you said to me last night, yung guy na gusto mo mag-effort na magparamdam sa'yo ulit at yayain kang magpakasal, mag yes ka ba? Kung ano, now if mag-effort siya now na mahal ko pa siya, tapos todo effort siya, yung ipaparamdam niya sa, lak- sa akin na sincere siya, I would say yes. Pero, pero dapat now niya na gawin. Don't wait na bago maging hindi yung lahat. Kasi pag ano na, hindi, hindi, hindi niya, ano siya? Pag hindi ko na siya mahal and then nagparamdam yung yayain niya ako magpakasa at nagparam, it's too late already. Once I've moved on, I can move on. Pero habang mahal ko pa siya, he must do it right now. Pero I think hindi niya, hindi niya rin gagawin, I think. Hindi naman ako mahal noon. Ako lang naman yung nagmamahal o, di ba? Kasi, bakit ako, ganito ako kasi, bakit ako nagiging honest sa, ano ko, sa feelings ko? Kasi ayaw ko ng regrets. Ayaw kong magsisi sa bandang huli. Kasi, na- naranasan ko na kung, ano, yung asawa ko, di ba, namatay. So, nagsisi ako kasi hindi ko pinaramdan yung mga bagay na dapat pinaramdam ko sa kanya. So, do- may na-learn akong lesson. No? It's one of the lessons that I'll learn that, if you love someone, tell them. Ganun. You will never know what you will never know what will happen tomorrow. So why not say it now? Wala namang mawawala sa iyo, di ba? So yun. <laughs> so what is it? Yung next question is hidden identity ayun yung magpakilala. So here is the question. What makes you fall out of love easily? Simple. Cheater. Once you cheated on me, there's no more second chances. I would, I will, I will, bye-bye again. <laughs> Ganon. <laughs> bye-bye. No more second chances. Why would I? Yung ginawa niya nga, ano, ginawa niya the first time. There's a tendency na gagawa niya ulit. So, magiging repeat cycle na lang niya. So, the first thing na gawin niya na, then goodbye again. Ganon. I don't believe in, what is it, love is sweeter the, the second time around. I don't believe in second chances chances so here it is ah uh, no and then yung isa is pag crush ko pa pag crush ko siya and then i found out that he is in a relationship and committed already to someone else then in a blink of an eye my my feelings will fade you know wala na it will blown away by the wind <laughs> ganun ganun ako maano Kasi I, it's hard for me to love because I know I, I love hard. And last but not the least question, 
So, this is pang Miss Universe yung question niya. Grabe, napawawa ko dito. As in, super, super. So, her, her question was, If you were given a chance to be Miss Universe, single mom edition, what is your greatest and sincere advice to the next generation? <laughs> so, my answer is, if I will be given a chance to be the Miss Universe Single Mom Edition, my greatest and sincere advice to this generation is to follow your parents first. Finish your studies because parents knows best. Okay? It's all for it's for all it's for your own good. Strict man sila, then let them be. Because they are only trying to protect you. Look at me. I became a single mother, for we all know I became a single mother because, not because my husband cheated on me, but because my husband passed away. But the fact that I got pregnant at the age of 19, I know I wasn't ready. I know I'm too young to handle responsibilities. And, I know, look at me, I work abroad because I didn't finish my studies. I work abroad, so my children was left behind in the Philippines, and when their father passed away, no one looked after them, only my parents, no no parents is in their side, so I, I don't want that to happen to my, to my children, kaya I always tell them, please, Forgive me if I'm so strict right now. Kasi sabi ko, it's for your own good. Just listen to me. I know what's best for you. Just finish your study. Follow what I say. Kasi, by the time na nakatapos na kayo ng pag-aaral nyo, by the time you finish your university, you can do whatever you want. You can marry. What You can do whatever you want. Just for now, bear with me. <laughs> Forgive me. Uh, for now, you will hate me. But later on, you will thank me because of my strictness. Because... Sabi niyo nga, di ba? Uh, sabi ko sa anak ko, I know you hate me. There were times na you hated me. Dahil sa pagka-strict ako. But, but someday, time will come that you will thank me for what I did. So, yun. I know, kahit ma- uh, the good thing now is kahit nasa malayo ako, um, I can still guide them. Yung ano yung tama at mali. Uh, buti na, uh, buti na mabait yung mga anak ko. And thankful ako doon. Hindi man ako lucky enough sa love life. I know at first I was lucky because I have, I had a husband na yung love me unconditionally. Yun. But uh, kahit wala na yung asawa ko, I have my children. Which I'm so lucky kasi hindi sila pasaway. And ganun. Sana uh, sa, leg- sa generation ngayon, tapusin yung pag-aaral. Makilig muna sa magulang, tapusin yung pag-aaral. Okay, kasi para din sa inyo yan. Kasi kung ayaw nyo magsisi sa bandang huli, kung ayaw nyo maghirap sa bandang huli pa sa mga anak nyo. So you have to listen to your parents, finish your study, and that's it. And hope na gustuhan nyo itong vlog ko. And sana may napulit kayo kahit konting aral. Please, please, don't forget to like, subscribe, to my channel <laughs> okay guys thank you everyone thanks for watching bye god bless